Lorenzo. Um, I am a aspirant of the De La Salle Brothers for four years now. And I am a third year hospitality management student of University of St. Lasalle. I'm Cyril. I'm the current Associate Dean of Student Affairs of De La Salle University. I used to work with the Lasallian Pastoral Office. Hi, I am Brother Mark from the Lasallian Formation Center. Everyone, regardless of your engagement and affiliation in life, is invited to respond and to be associated in living out the Lasallian mission. It is also inclusive since we do not choose who to serve. The Lasallian vocation that I am living out and responding to today is being a LaSalle brother. Discovering this vocation was not a solo task, but rather is the fruit of the moments of accompaniment. When I was a student, I was very much involved with a movement called the Student Catholic Action. And one day I attended the retreat, and uh, my retreat master told me to, uh, to enter politics. But it was evident at that moment that I enjoyed working with formation, with leadership, with youth and students. After that retreat, I made an initial commitment that wherever I go, I would serve the Filipino youth and students. I discovered the Aspirancy Program of the De La Salle Brothers uh, back when I was a grade 11 student. I was part of the Search and Park group. I came into contact with a young brother and he um, invited me to be part of the Vocation Summer Camp in Antipolo and Bagac. The uniqueness of our Lasallian vocation is that there are also specific calls within the call. The question that I have to ask myself is what role am I being invited to play in the future? It called me to become a, a responsible and hardworking citizen for my country. I was so inspired by their deep sense of faith, zeal of service, and expression of solidarity. It's something like making myself comfortable with my choices of what I do in life. A Lasallian vocation for me is witnessing my faith by being truly present and active in my reality. With the Aspirancy Program, um, I met different people and I connected and bonded with them. These days are challenging for everyone where we experience so much inequalities and gaps in education, in the areas of socioeconomic, political, and even spiritual. And I encourage the youth and students to, to listen, to pay attention, to be open and engage in several initiatives where you feel you love to do that would help you grow as a better Christian, a better Lasallian, and a Filipino citizen. Discover and live out and nurture your specific talents and hopefully roles in the Lasallian family. Always pray for God's guidance. These uh, challenges would widen our perspective and enable us to explore God's unique invitation in our life. There are so many opportunities that we can see Jesus, that we can discover Jesus and His message to us. How? You already know. You just need to take a leap of faith. Are you willing to listen and be open and embrace God's love today? Are you willing to take the risk of saying yes to God's invitation today and onwards? Are you ready to jump not into the multiverse like Doctor Strange, but the multi-dimensional roles that we play as Lasallians?